I'm here at Regions because uh, under the leadership of Mary Brainerd and, and Dr. Nelson and others, you've been at this effort for a number of years. In fact, uh, Health Partners started a safety initiative with other uh, hospitals in this area 10 years ago. We're a little late catching up with uh, Medicare and Medicaid, but we think it's time. I actually was in an operating room and saw some of the step-by-step -step procedures that are going on. Everybody's involved. Uh, it, it's about who cleans the operating room, because if the cleaning isn't done appropriately, somebody could get an infection. It's the air cooling system has to be part of this effort. It's everybody who comes into that room as part of an engaged team. Um, so I'm here to find out what a system looks like where this effort has been underway for a while and what kinds of new strategies we can learn and then share with other hospital administrators, other patients, other providers across the country. Amazing work uh, going on here at Regents Hospital. I think can't think of a better place for you to visit when it comes to uh, trying to prevent errors. As you know, Health Partners has taken some courageous steps um, as really the first uh, in the nation. Uh, to uh, stop payments for extremely rare medical errors called uh, never events and they really have set a standard by doing that. Uh, you also have a hospital that's taken uh, a lot of measures to prevent everything from reinfections to uh, problems with surgery. So We're, we're not going to compete on patient safety. Our patients deserve better than that. So that premise that we're not going to compete on safety and that we're going to collaborate was important. Another important premise is that none of us have the license on what's best. That we're better off learning from each other, and so our work has been very intentional about sharing. It's better, so get ready for show and tell, because <laughs> it's, it's definitely coming, and um, again, congratulations for the great work you're doing. Thank you. And so I want to take the opportunity to say thank you for the incredible work that you've done. Every once in a while, we need to pause and celebrate, and this gives us a chance to do that. And for many of us, it serves as motivation to take the next step um, and a reminder of how important the work is. So 